This is James Byrne from the Bayshore High School Tech Team, and this is a Windows 10 Top 10 for Teachers. Today I'm going to show you how to connect your computer to a projector and play around with some display settings. First of all, to access the display settings, you're going to go down here to the Start menu, click on Settings, System, and then finally Display. Okay. The first thing I'm going to do is show you how to make a shortcut to this. This will make it easier for you to access the display settings and save you a bunch of time when you are hooking your computer up to a projector. So I'm going to X out of this, and I'm going to go down here to the Start menu, Settings, System, and instead of left-clicking on the display, I'm going to right-click on the display, and yours is going to say Pin to Start. So go ahead and select Pin to Start, and then when you go back down to the Start menu, you're going to see your display icon right here, and you can go right to it. Okay, so that'll save you a bunch of time. All right, there's a couple ways to detect to a projector. I'm going to mention two. The first one is actually, I think, maybe the easiest one. Uh, I can't really demonstrate it to you here because it, it actually starts with your computer closed and uh, maybe or in sleep mode. It's the easiest. So just make sure your computer's closed or in sleep mode. Go ahead and plug your projector in, turn it on, and once the projector's on, waiting for a signal, all you got to do is open up your computer or wake it from sleep. Your computer should then automatically detect your projector and connect to it. If that doesn't work, or if you want to connect to your projector while you're already using the computer, just uh, make sure the projector's on and plugged into your computer. Then go down to your Start menu, go conveniently to your display icon, and then just hit Detect. It should, at that point, detect your second window, uh, second display there. And then you want to go down here and make sure this is on Duplicate these displays. Okay. You should be all set. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. For more information, contact a member of the Bayshore High School Tech Team.